okay so you guys um, we were having some problems with this uh, Chewy uh, V88 I uh, hard bricked the, the device uh, by taking out the USB cable while flashing that was uh, not so smart of me so um, I had some uh, few days to find out what the problem was how I could fix it I was almost ready to throw it away but um, thanks to the guys of Slate Droid and XDA we found a uh, method to fix this Chewy you can see it's off now I will turn it on let me see you can see it's working now I just uh, did a new ROM installation first of all if you want to fix this device you have to open it up so you open the device by um, going here first I will get uh, my special tool for opening this device yes it's a lollipop stick so you open it uh, by sticking here you see this plastic things here when you click it there it will open and first one you have to do is do this one here and this one here because if you do it there it's already gapped so that's a good thing that Chewy didn't make this uh, tablet so good uh, is here you can find already a gap so you can stick something plastic here and then you can open it so when it's open uh, you look for this these are the NAND mod modules I think 8 gig here 8 gig here so that's uh, 16 gig um, here's your USB connection here's your power connection and you need to get uh, maybe I can show you better you need to look here you see the dots this dot means this pin here is number one so what you do from here you go from here to counting one two three to seven eight or pins eight and nine for me what worked was pins seven eight you need to short those or short eight and nine when you short this you will uh, see that your um, Android tool is giving a message I will show you now this Android tool um, I used this Android tool and I found it here at Oma's uh, ROM uh, the, the new ROM 4.22 version 3.2 so I use this ROM to clear, uh, to erase the IDB. You need to erase the IDB. When you do that, um, you can go to this one here. The Rockchip Batch Tool version 1.6. Now already, I already had this one because I used it for my people and for my N80RK. So when you go open this up as administrator, right click administrator then you see here it will be blue so when it's blue you can uh, load your your update load it and make restore and then it will start flashing and when it's finished flashing it will take about maybe four minutes five minutes when that is done your Chewy will be live again so let's go back to the Chewy um, you can see then that the Chewy will be uh, um, in the tool you can see it's installing so the most important thing of this is to try to short the correct pins so for me it was from here this this module not this one uh, some people said I needed to do with the sticker so this sticker was on here so I tried first this but it didn't work for me so for me I don't know for you guys but for me it was this module this is number one and count from here so when you do it correctly your Chewy will be alive again and you can use your uh, Chewy as you would have before you messed up your uh, Chewy so this is a little bit of instruction video so please uh, I'm uh, made this video to just to help you guys because you guys of Slidroid and XDA helped me very good to fix this uh, Chewy so bye bye for now. Thank you.